So we have just the one to do here. Uh, let's start by taking a look at how the uh, sort of the, the existing version looks. So we have this global feed. Everything in here says it needs decoding. Oh, hey, we now have the article that I posted. <laughs> Great, um, from the previous exercise. <clears throat> well, it also needs decoding. So uh, all of these things are relying on the same decoder for metadata, which currently has everything as hard-coded. Um, so essentially, let's, uh, let's convert these. So uh, metadata is a uh, type alias that's defined up here. So it's got description, which is a string, title, which is a string, list of tags, favorited, favorites count, and created at. And created at is the only one that's currently filled in with required. So let's just go down the line. <clears throat> so the first one we're going to need is a required description. And that one is a string. Then we're going to need uh, another required one. In fact, all these are going to be required. So uh, title. Title is also a string. Then we have uh, tag list, oops, uh, which is not a string, but a list of strings. And so we're going to call the list function inside the json.decode module um, and pass it string decoder so that it turns that from a single string decoder to a, a decoder of list of strings. Then we've got uh, favorited, which is a Boolean. That'll just be bool. And finally, we have favorites count, which is an int. Okay. Um, let's see. Oh, yeah. Order matters. These must be decoded in the same order, the order of the fields in type alias metadata above. So let's just double check that we got those in the right order. Description, title, tag list, uh, favorited, favorites count, and created at. Looks good. Let's rebuild. That worked. Let's refresh. Go to the global feed. And hey, we've got article titles again, including this excellent piece that I wrote here, which I all suggest you read uh, afterwards because I think it's really got a lot to say.